If you want better low-end in your productions, then you should watch this video. Hi, I'm Stefan from Mix66 and in my last video I showed you a trick how to use the sidechain function in Oak Sound Soof 2 to get rid of cymbal bleed in your shell mics. You can use the same technique on your bass instruments to clean up your low end. In modern metal there are a lot of instruments competing in the low end area. You have the kick drum, the bass and many synth layers with sub bass information. The low end is one of the most important criteria which separates the amateur mixes from the pro mixes. So I will show you now this trick that will clean up your low end and improve your whole productions. Let's jump into the DAW. As in the last video we have the live recording of my band here. Once again we can have a short view, that's me playing drums. And this time I want to show you a little trick how you can clean up your low end. So here we have kick drum, this is the kick drum bus. And the bass guitar. And here's both of them together. To clean up the low end I will insert Soof 2 on the bass track and I will send the kick drum bus to the bass track as a sidechain. I will enable sidechain Soof 2, let's listen if I have done everything correctly. Yes, here is the kick drum. Now if we play them both together you can see that every time the bass drum hits we will have a reduction from Soof 2. But we want to clean the low end, so let's adjust the sidechain curve for Soof 2. Let's focus on the main frequency of the kick drum, which should be around 80. Adjust some settings, make it a little sharper. Hard mode. Attack as fast as possible, release as fast as possible. I set the sharpness and selectivity of Soof 2 quite high. I choose the hard mode and adjusted the depth to my liking. Let's listen how it sounds. Now let's listen to it with and without Soof 2 enabled. I hope you are listening to it on good speakers or good headphones. If you do so, you will notice immediately how it sounds cleaner when Soof 2 is enabled. So there you have it, this is my trick to clean up your low end. Remember you could use this technique also on synth basses and on any other instruments. You could also use it on your guitars and vocals to clean up your mid-range. The sky is the limit. And if you are a music producer who struggles to take their career further, then I have something special for you. Click the link in the description and you can start the Mix66 career diagnosis right now. The Mix66 career diagnosis will identify your weak points and give you guides to overcome them, so that you can build the career of your dreams. Just click the link in the description and start it now. As always, please subscribe to this channel and see you next time. Bye.